Well, it's a quick little video heard more in El Torino, and it's like a whole spread of food in here. And something happened to you, Gina. What happened? My boot got grazed a bit by the server. Uh oh. Herb, what are you gonna do? Are you gonna are you gonna fight him? Are you gonna do something? I think it's kind of funny. You think it's funny? Mm -hmm. Herb, that's not appropriate to think that. And Guibo's over here, and I don't think he wants to be seen I'm too much. Down. Yeah, chowing down. Right now, yeah. We got the shrimp fajitas. And you got the skinny girl margarita. Skinny girl margarita. And I don't know how much more we'll show today. We're probably going to go to a, a Walmart or something. And, you know, Costco's, we wanted to go there today because you wanted to get another bottle or something. And they closed it at 6 on the week weekends. Isn't that ridiculous? I know. I know. So we'll see what else we do. Right, Gina? You, you all right after I'm being still, assaulted? I'm still deciding what I'm worried about. Yeah. So... I just left El Torito, and they're still in there. So I'm just gonna walk over to this Blockbuster. Like one of the few ones open, there's like two of them left out where we are. There's actually a lot of people in here, surprisingly. Like I don't even know if people really came in Blockbusters anymore. It seems there's like a lot of people. And I don't think there's any good sales at all going on. People looking at me probably like I'm nuts. Yeah, there was absolutely no sales going on at there and there at all. All the Blu-rays that were, um, you know, that 5 for 20 thing are just the regular price now. So it's like, ugh, really not good prices at all in there now. Well, I think we're going to go to Barnes & Noble and then um, Walmart. So this is a little, just for, you know, Sheets & Giggles vlog. What are we doing, Gina? You tell me. You said you wanted to get a new dress and Ross dress for last? I did not. You said you wanted to look for Blu-rays. Now, see, someone said that to me, but I'm sure that's total crap. <laughs> I don't know. This well, is kind let's of. Let's go. I can get you some new shoes. All right, let's I go. Heard they sell some cute panties in there. So. This is just a random one of those one of those random vlogs. You know what I mean? No specific reasonings behind yeah, you just anything. Just whipped it out here, like let's film it. Specific that, that Gina got filled up in the. Yeah. Yeah, that was why I whipped it out in the first place. Is Gina got filled up in the El Torito? But he really wasn't, because everybody knows that if you just brush against somebody like that, that's, that's not really what they getting filled up like this. It wasn't it. this. That's filled up. Yeah. yeah. Hey man, yeah, let me help you with that. Yeah, oh, there's some shoes. Pay, pay Let's take them. Oh boy, I bet they got the skates. Maybe they have athlete's foot on them. Oh, oh. Nice shoes, athlete. They seem like new shoes. Maybe someone stole them and then realized that their crime was not worth it. You know, all the DVDs they had, at least like half of them were from Canada. They were like, and they were in French in the back. <laughs> you couldn't really show them because it was just, you know. But um, they had Mr. Wood and Balls. Remember Mr. Woodcock yeah, on Blu ray? He was mean. I think I turned that off 10 minutes in. He was so mean. Yeah, I wasn't that great. You don't see much of Billy Bob Thornton anymore. I liked him in school for scoundrels, and that was fun. His funny. face is like before. Yeah, he's done some weird stuff himself, yeah. and wears that weird piece and everything. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know what he. I, I mean, the real him looks he never like. Never got over what's her name leaving him. No, but the real him looks like he didn't sling blade. You know what I mean? <laughs> That's how I think he looks. Like, green tomatoes. Hey, French fried taters. Mm hmm. So you wanna know why I do what I do? What are you doing, Duivo? All right, Duivo. So Herb, let's go out front and let's talk about. Come on. Let's talk about. That's something. We should talk about that movie. You know, we saw yesterday, The Bad Teacher. Bad Teacher? And what, I like Bad Teachers. This movie will actually have a reason to talk about something. Yeah. Didn't oh. you think it was good? Like, some people left, like, were saying, oh, it's so raunchy and stuff. And so, audience. first of all, I love raunchy movies anyway, and it really wasn't that raunchy, I didn't well, think. Well, I must be, uh, have bad taste, because I must be raunchy, because I didn't think it was raunchy at all. I didn't really think the it was. Kid. Did you think Bad Teacher was really that raunchy? No. But a lot of people were going, oh, it's so raunchy. It was no more raunchy than like any of those other, uh, any of those other movies. Yeah, I didn't know. think the it was. The chubby little kid in the class was the one from my car that always takes off his shirt and starts dancing. Right? Yeah. yeah. But I think people, I thought it was pretty good, though, because we, I don't think we're going to do a big review on it, but I think people should no. look, check it out, don't you? Yeah, I do, even though I don't really like her that much. No. I, did, I sort of liked her in this. She had too much makeup on. Yeah. I was, the one for Freaks and Geeks. But I think it's the makeup artist's fault, though. No. Sometimes no. Sometimes a makeup artist. She's got a real bad complexion problem. 
I know that. that. You know what looks really good, though, from that trailer is that Nick Swartzen one about him going to be a porn star. And the guy from Maryland, um, or, you know, Brendan Hardesty, I think, is in that movie. As I remember, he was mentioning about that. I'm pretty sure he is. Hmm. And he used to work at the giant that we used to always go to. Really? He did. Yeah, that's where he used to be. What, a like, uh, Yeah, I knew I saw him before, and that's where I saw him. And then he used to come in Regal Cinema 100 by 12 all the time. And I used to say to him, do people ever recognize you? And he said, no. And I thought that was really weird. That is weird. So instead, we're going into Target because, you know, the Walmart's a bit further away. And it's another, it's another you know, thing we're doing for this random day. What's that tent over there? I don't know, Gina. Probably. No, it's probably where they have all the workmen live. That's where they have all the storage. Yeah, house. all the workmen stay in there. Well, workmen? Who are remodeling this target. No, they're not making the work. They live in there no. and sleep there. No, they sleep in there. That's where they sleep, they Herb. Sleep They've got all got cots. Like, and Major <laughs> Payne is in there. Uh, you, know, you know, yelling at them. Yeah, there's a lot of construction going on here. Oh, well. I guess we got to go to the sheety target. Man, this target is a mess. It's a messed up target. There's like all this, like not a lot of things not here. All these tarps in the wall back there. Jeez. Oh, it's got. Yeah, yet again, all the Tylenol's gone. Yeah, yeah. yeah, the one thing I take in, then they don't have it. Well, they have the medicine. Yeah. Same thing. Oh, what a butt. I don't know what that is with Tylenol. It's always having recalling problems. It is the same thing. I know. I found a Sonic here, though. That's what the dentist recommended, so I'm going to use that and see if it makes a difference in the plaque and whatnot. Yeah. It's probably, you're probably going to go to the next dentist and have, like, six cavities. No, I, I've never had more than one cavity. Yeah. This Sonic. one's a trouble tooth. It's like my sweet tooth. Yeah. Well, they, they they now put these in these kind of bottles. I don't even know what this is. Right. I know, and I, I, you think it gives you the you know a bit of the squirts? Yeah, I don't even want to know it's in green. I know you were having some kind of a, a weird mood earlier. Drew. What's wrong? I'm not really in the mood to be filmed every day. So. What's your problem with it? I'm not one of those daily vlogger kind of things. I'm not Shay Carl. I'm gonna put myself out there every day and have my huge beard in my face and shit. You're not one of the Shay tarts. No. I don't know why he calls him Tars. I mean, that's sort of offensive. I mean, it is. I think that's the joke. I watched that other guy, Fam Damling, who only has like 2,000 subscribers and he does daily vlogs with his sons. He's pretty funny. Yeah. Should probably, they should swap for one. He should have like 400 million subscribers. Yeah. He put it all in one bag? Mm -hmm. Oh, geez. So I would just say, I guess, say goodbye from this video. It's random See, video. This closed up first. Yeah. I like those new shaped bottles. Looks like a woman's body. Yeah. Well, when you talk about stuff like that, Gina was already molested, molested in the, I you know. Exactly close no, I was molested in the dentist's office. That was worse. Oh, jeez. Nope. Not recently, years ago, right? Yeah, I was 13, getting oh. my wisdom teeth out. Oh. He took liberties. And then, like, the one guy I went to speech therapy with, we found out later, wasn't he a deviant? Yeah, watch yourself. Remember that one in Baltimore? Yeah, and that woman woke up and her underpants were on backwards. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh no. no. Oh, she got. Jeez. She realized when she got out that her underwear was on backwards. You think he could have been more careful? <laughs> he didn't know how to put them on. They were a new brand, I, I guess. guess. He wasn't sure about how they worked. Oh no. Yeah. Well, we'll see you guys later.